What's up guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video. Today, I'm going to be taking you on a tour of some of the best skate parks in Sacramento, so let's get right to it. First up on the list, Wild Rose Skate Park. I would say this skate park, even though it's one of the smallest in Sacramento, is still one of the most fun. It's going in a circle and you can just continuously hit lines on so many different features. And I honestly love this park. I grew up riding this park. So yeah, let's get some clips. I think first we'll hit this little snake run area right over here. And then once we hit that, then we'll hit a couple of street obstacles with knee pads on. Heck yeah. That was pretty good if you ask me. Uh, never flipped that hip actually. All right, now it's time to show you guys the rest of the park. I know we'll skedaddle in the next park, which is Tanzanite. There is water in front of the gap, so I'm only gonna hit the A-frame. I'll do a trick over it, and then I'll hit the hubba. hitting the rail and then tanzanite all right see you guys at tanzanite i also wanted to give my dad a huge shout out for lending me his mini because my car has a blown turbo currently anyway this is tanzanite skate park yet another skate park where i learned basically all of my tricks growing up as a kid and honestly memorable park huge bowls and a lot of fun there's also this smaller bowl which has a great fly out and a couple of good quarters in here it's a lot of fun to sesh around on i've learned a lot of tricks here and if you use the pocket of the bowl if you're ballsy enough you can hit this gap all the way over into the street section my teammate cory pastor did it then there's also this really cool street section which I learned most of my grinds techie stuff and this rail is always sticky this next section is probably one of my favorites it has a really nice step up and a couple of big hubbas you can use these several different ways all these ramps are steep <laughs> this is a big park and for some reason everything's steep and a little slippery there's also this gigantic three block and super steep stairs I'm looking straight down right now and look at, there's another step up bank right there and it's so steep. But anyway, let's get some clips.
All right. And for my last trick, I'm gonna be doing a flare over the big bump right here. So stick around. Last but not least, at Tanzanite, there's actually a really famous secret street spot. If you keep walking down this path that I just showed you, you're gonna reach, I don't even know what these are, the canals, I guess? But look at this. This is like a giant drop-in. I've seen some people jump onto this and then jump off. I've seen people drop in. I've seen people do flares on this little, on the little quarters, on the sides. I would recommend if you guys ever come to Tanzanite that you check out this spot because it is actually super sick. So I filmed at four skate parks on this day and decided that I really wanted to make this a series. Next video I'm going to be talking about the Robertson Center Skate Park and 28th and B. Both really fun skate parks and I think you guys would enjoy them too. If you guys want to see this in the future, hit that bell icon so that you're notified anytime I post. Make sure you subscribe, make sure you like, and I will catch you guys in the next one. And by the way, I have filmed a lot of skate park tours actually, and I never got around to editing them. If you guys want to see tours around Napa area, please comment that down below and I'll make sure to get that out to you guys ASAP, okay? I'll catch you guys in the next one, alright? Peace.